Hello Leo, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Welcome to this video. I hope that you're doing well. So let's see what's going on. Okay, so you could be kind of undecided about something right now. Or it seems like there was going to be this decision that hasn't happened yet. You could be seeking the answers like internally, trying to figure out, figure it out within yourself, within your mind, within your emotions. Um, you could be also kind of retreating away from a certain situation, from a certain person. You could have misjudged, you could have thought someone was your soulmate here, but like they weren't. Um, for some Leos, that's what happened. For other Leos, it's that you could feel like someone who is your soulmate um, made a poor judgment call about the situation or didn't really see it the way that you did. Okay, so you could be dealing with a Virgo or an Aquarius. It looks like this time that you have away with the Hermit card here gives you a lot of hope and inspiration. Like you're really trying to refill your energy and um, collect your energy, collect your mind in a way that feels like you're optimistic and excited about, you know, just the day ahead, the week ahead. So we have Queen of Wands, or Queen of Wands in Five of Coins reverse. Someone's maybe wondering, like, what I got from these cards for some reason, someone's thinking, like, why didn't you say something? I don't know what that was about, but it's either you or this person is thinking, if that's the case, like someone, someone might have said something that was harsh or like false for some, or like you found something out and someone's wondering why didn't you say anything. Like they're confused about the other person's actions and they're like, if this was the case, why didn't you just say so? That could be about a few different things, but hmm. could be dealing with an Aries. But someone has a lot of hope for this situation. Um, they're sick of waiting, though. Could be you, could be a person. Someone's like sick of waiting for the other person to approach them or to try to work on things because it just seems like there is this delay in, in progress here. I think it's because someone is trying to or someone is just having extra time to themselves right now, which makes sense. Um, so we have honeymoon, okay. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. I think you make this person very happy. They're very blissful in your presence often. Yeah, so we have separation. Um, someone's definitely taking a step away, some time away maybe like a break or someone's like you know I need some space to try to find this like hope for my life love yourself first um, this could be what's kind of happening here is that someone's like this situation could have been hurting you a lot so you're like you know I need to separate from this so that I can just feel more positive more happy more excited about my life so you have calling in your soulmate as well yeah, you could have been like, you know, this isn't the person that I'm supposed to be with for some um, Leos. This could be something that you realized um, pretty recently here. So it could be an act of self-love on your part to like separate from this person. Could have seemed like the only solution because like I said, it seems like you were having difficulties working with this person or maybe honestly discussing things like this person may have not told you some stuff or that was like important to your connection like they left a lot of information out or you did um, but like something got messed up here to the point where someone's like okay I just need time away to try to try to figure things out for myself hmm yeah, so it looks like you may be trying to call in someone new. You could be trying to manifest someone new into your life. Someone who will feel like you, um, someone who will feel more 
well connected and someone who's better for your emotional health if you did have to separate this person because they put you in a situation where your self-respect is compromised then um, yeah you're like I I want to find someone who I won't it won't be an issue you know where it won't hurt me so much emotionally to be with them or something like this um, could also be so yeah for some people it's like that for some people you guys had to take a break to try to find some like things on your own figure out life on your own for some time but they may actually call you they may talk to you because like I said someone seems like they're sick of waiting um, or they're sick of this separation as well like they want to talk I surrender to the power of prayer and devotion so this was in reverse um, could be necessary necessary for you to just to hear that I guess um, to try to surrender to the power of prayer and devotion maybe you're devoting yourself to other places now I welcome clear vision and inspired action there is a lot about inspiration here so yeah I think a lot of Leo's are trying to clear their vision about this situation um, and they're feeling inspired with this new like it's almost like someone's having a lot of introspection a lot of really interesting internal dialogue and this is like giving them a very clear vision feeling very inspired to like take action in their life I meet resistance with kindness so yeah you could have um, in this situation like you know this person could have been doing some things that were making it really difficult for you to continue with them and then you were kind in return because this is the person that you are and you're not gonna go be rude to someone just because they're a rude person you know so you met them with kindness but it looks like at some point you're like okay like I have to walk away at this point um, or at least for some time I craft my core desires with certainty and ease I think a lot of Leos are manifesting more than they realize like this positivity that you're bringing into your life is doing more for you than, than you realize okay so we have planetary cycles in reverse you could have been kind of going in circles with this person like you had this cycle with them of something um, where maybe you're really trying to get through the get through to them or to like get them to understand but it wasn't working out so you would just go in circles but now since this is in reverse you just kind of decided to end the whole thing because you couldn't get out of this circle with this person well so we also have inspiration so much about inspiration here you guys may have found something or someone um, or started doing some things that really make you feel inspired we also have love okay you could be inspired to to find a really beautiful love or to be more loving um, after after this situation you could be finding a lot of love for yourself but also just for your life for people in your life for things in your life um, and I think this person that you're dealing with it may be that they feel very inspired by you and like they love you so we also have courage okay so whatever it is that you're feeling inspired about hmm. whatever it is that you're manifesting as well it's like very courageous for you to take this step um, in your life to make these changes that you are and also have the courage to still be loving despite having been hurt you know because um, if you just stop if you were to stop being loving just because someone else wasn't loving then who's who's gonna be loving in your life you know if it's not coming from you then that's you have that much less love in your life if that makes sense because you're always with yourself you know so if you're not being loving imagine how much less love you'll have in your life so I think you are still like and also with this uh, I mean resistance with kindness it's just kind of like okay 
this situation this situation went this way or um, I had to separate from this person I had to take a break from this thing these people but you're still gonna have the courage to be your loving self adaptability yeah so you may be someone who's very adaptable you have the ability to adjust to your circumstances and also to have your to adjust your circumstances um, to wherever you're at so you also have decision you could be making a very courageous decision about love this person could actually be making the decision to find the courage to like come and talk to you because someone's sick of just thinking about this and not taking any action so now they're like okay what can I actually do in this situation so you also have generosity, yeah, um, over courage. So you're you're still having the courage to be a generous person in your life, because um, that's something you appreciate about yourself, you know. In companionship, your your companions appreciate this about you as well. You could be meeting some new friends. You could find a new friend, get in contact with an old friend. Um, could also just be more focused on your friends right now, really appreciating the friends that you have in your life feeling inspired by them, I think they're feeling inspired by you, and if you have the courage to be generous, you know people, your companions are inspired by your example. So this person says, I'm focusing on money right now, I was hurt by someone before you, so if this person was really held back, they could have not had the courage to, to put themselves forward or to be vulnerable because they were hurt by this person before them so they just didn't have that courage yet but I think maybe they're trying to move past that I love you I wish you were here with me you hurt me okay so this person felt hurt by you as well the situation hurt them I want to buy you flowers okay this is over courage and generosity so I think this person really is trying to find the courage to like make to do something nice for you to to maybe buy you flowers or buy you some kind of gift or to just like make something for you so many things remind me of you I'm sick of faking and wearing a mask this person may be someone who's a little bit fake and like doesn't just kinda like has some false pretenses I think about you every day yeah this person's always thinking of like what can I do to approach Leo and I think so highly of you um, you really inspire them. I think they really value and appreciate your your character and your moral integrity. It looks like you're someone who who gets through things well because you know you know how to adapt to your circumstances. You know, um, you know how to persevere and and get through everything. They think very highly of you for that and for how loving you are, like you inspire them, they think that you're really generous and courageous and they appreciate this about you. Okay, thank you Leos, this is all that I have to say. I hope that you have a good day or night, I hope that you're safe and that your family is safe and healthy, and I hope that you have a good day or night. If you enjoyed this reading, um, you can tip me, the link for that is in the description of this video if you'd like to, and also if you'd like a personal reading, the email for that is in the description of this video as well. Just email me and we can discuss prices or readings, you can ask certain questions about your situation and things like this. Thank you!